Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the Marlin 1894 chambered in 357 Magnum. I've showed this off before, but today we're gonna check out a little bit further back, a little distance shooting with this at 100 yards, then 125 yards with the 357 Magnum. Now it does hold eight rounds in the mag tube and it's a side loader. And it looks like a polymer stock, it's actually wood. So it's a heavy duty stock there does have a wide loop for the lever action, which is paracord wrapped, comes with a paracord sling. And I've really enjoyed this rifle from the time that I've owned it. And I, I still do, it's very, very nice. But the optic that I have here is a Vortex Spitfire. What I like about this is that it is etched glass, but it does illuminate. It's a one power, so we're gonna see how well this whole thing will work out but i'm really looking forward to it and we'll see i'm gonna back up to 100 yards all right here we are marlin 1894 100 yards away from that plate i've got regular target loads in here 158 grain 357 and the optic that i have here is a vortex spitfire they have a three times power spitfire but they also have a one power and that's what this is but it's got a great reticle Let's see how it goes. I think I went high. There we go. Wow. Yep. I have to tilt the ejector down. Yep, pretty consistent at 100 yards. I can just tell that it's hitting harder than the 9mm did. And that's to be expected, but it's nice to get out here and check it out. Yeah, looks like one more. Let's go ahead and tag that target. Well, I missed the first one. I went probably an inch high, but I tagged the rest. I believe that was eight shots, and uh, I was seven for eight at 100 yards with the Marlin. All right, I backed up to 125 yards. I took a few shots already. I noticed that I had to account for about four inches of bullet drop, which is less than what I had to do with the Ruger Charger when I shot nine millimeter. Well, let's check this out. 125 Vortex Spitfire. Here we go. Impact. I don't know if that hit. It's amazing the difference between 25 yards. I know that one did. Twenty-five yards wouldn't be much at all with a precision rifle, but 357 makes a more of a difference. That last one I missed. I saw the dust cloud. I may have missed that one too. Impact. Impact again. Is that it? I have one more. Oh, just missed. Well, I've got my tactical frog blanket, which gives me precise power, but I'm sure having fun, and I really do love this Marlin 1894. So there it is, Marlin 1894 Dark Series, a new series 
from Marlin. I did okay. I didn't do great. Some of those misses were shooter's error. Most of the time, it's shooter's error when misses occur, but we backed up a little bit. We shot 357 from this Marlin, and I sure had fun. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.